Tesla first introduced Model S in 2012. Since then, it has earned a lot of recognition and awards like Motor Trend's Ultimate Car of the Year. The car, now 7 years old, has never seen a full redesign, but the 2019 Model S has evolved significantly from the first iteration of the car. From losing its front grills and sunroofs to increasing its range, here are all the major changes Tesla has made to the flagship Model S. Unlike other mainstream car manufacturers that may significantly update their vehicles before a full redesign, Tesla has taken a different route, implementing small aesthetics and mechanical changes over the course of each vehicle's life cycle. While investing substantially more resources into over-the-air software updates, that improves the vehicles internally. And since its introduction, the Model S has undergone many changes, including updates to its drive unit, as well as exteriors and interior aesthetic modifications. Here is a timeline of some of the major changes the popular electric luxury sedan has undergone since its introduction, both in its aesthetics and in its programming and driving features. In 2013, Tesla released Model S P85 Plus. LED eyebrow daytime running lights were available in 2013 as a part of the $3,500 technology package, according to Green Car Reports. But after September 2013, the DRLs became standard equipment on the Model S even without the package, according to the Tesla Motors Club. The tech package included features like 7 years of map, keyless entry, and memory seats. Tesla also introduced the Model S P85 that year, according to Motor Trend. A 40 kilowatt hour Model S was removed due to poorer sales, Autoblog reported. The P85 Plus was a more powerful Model S. While a Model S with a 60 kilowatt hour battery has a 0 to 60 time of 5.9 seconds and a top speed of 120 miles per hour, the P85 Plus could accelerate to 60 miles per hour in 4.2 seconds with a top speed of 129.9 miles per hour, according to Tesla. The 40 kilowatt hour battery was removed after only 4% of customers chose the option. A number too low to justify production, Tesla said. In 2014, Tesla Autopilot Driver Assist technology was introduced. Autopilot became an add-on option in September 2014. By the end of the year, all new Model S car included the camera, radar, and ultrasonic sensor hardware necessary for the addition. The functionality could be activated at any time for an additional fee. The company also released the first dual electric motor production car in the Model S in October 2014, the P85D. Tesla claimed that having an electric motor on each axle allowed for better traction and longer battery range. In 2015, Tesla created another tier of the premium interior package. The executive rear seat options was added as another tier to the premium interior package, according to the car and driver. The ER is provided to captain's chair style rear seats with two zone heaters and controls that allowed passengers to adjust media, climate, and panoramic sunroof settings with the Tesla app. Tesla also announced the new ludicrous mode for the P90D in 2015. The new ludicrous mode brought the 0 to 60 time down from 3.1 seconds to 2.8 seconds, according to Motor Trend. This option came with a $10,000 price tag and was only available for the new top of the line P90D. Launch mode was also introduced as a new function and allowed for quicker acceleration from the start line, according to Electrek. Tesla also released a new 70 kilowatt hour battery in the Model S 70D, which replaced 60 kilowatt hour version, according to the Green Car reports. The solid glass roof became an option in 2016. A few aesthetic changes to the Model S were made for 2016 model year. Tesla removed most of the forefront grill in 2016, giving the front a cleaner look. Also, a new vegan interior option was also added to the Model S P100D. According to Electrek, the glass sunroof became an option for the Model S and was endorsed by Elon Musk on Twitter. The solid glass roof cost about $500 less than the $2,000 panoramic roof. The three roof treatment options then became the painted roof, solid glass roof, or active panoramic roof. In terms of non aesthetic changes, the second version of autopilot hardware became standard after October 2016, according to Tesla. The full self driving capability option, which to date, has not yet been made widely available to the public, had a $3,000 price tag at delivery, according to The Verge. Tesla bumped up the performance times it codes for the car in 2017. Tesla improved the coded Model S 0-60 mph performance times, according to Electrek. The Model S 75's 
Time dropped from 5.5 seconds to 4.3. The Dual Motor 75D went from 5.2 seconds to 4.2 seconds. And the newer model S100D quickened from 4.2 seconds to 4.1 seconds. The 60 kilowatt hour version was discontinued. Further, the range for the 90D improved from 270 miles to 294 miles on a full charge and the P90D increased from 253 miles to 270 miles. Tesla said hardware and software improvements are to credit for the improved times. Tesla also started bundling its interior options, Electrek reported, and the glass roof and power lift became standard, according to Green Car reports. In 2018, Tesla changed the roof options again with panoramic sunroof removed as an option. Tesla cancelled several options. The company removed the panoramic sunroof in 2018, according to Electrek. Tesla also removed the black textile interior, rear-facing child seats, and 21-inch black arachnid wheel options. These changes were done to simplify product offerings for the customers, Tesla said. They also ended the referral program that includes lifetime supercharging for the original owner, Electrek reported at the time. Battery range for the 2019 Model S long range increased by 105 miles. When the Model S was first released, it had a range of 265 miles. The updated Model S long range option now has a 370 mile range with the help of a new electric motor, according to Motor Trend. Tesla also added new rolling resistance tires. Tesla dropped the option to outfit the car with a smaller battery, removing the 75 kilowatt early in 2019, Elon Musk tweeted. This left the base level battery at 100 kilowatt hour. Also, the adaptive air suspension was upgraded according to a message posted to Tesla's official Twitter account. Two Model S builds are available right now. The long range for $72,115 and the performance for $92,115. The Model S in 2021. The 2021 Model S will arrive with an improved 402-mile EPA range and introduces an 1100 HP plated model that can compete the 0 to 60 miles per hour under 2 seconds, and it retails at an MSRP of $138,490. Offered in two trims, the price has dropped significantly to match competitors and starts from $67,920 for the long range plus and goes up to $90,420 for the performance. Released in October 2020, the Model S is available for sale across all dealership via walk-ins and direct deliveries. All set for launch in 2021, an 1100 HP Model S Plaid will finally sit at the top of the Model S trim lineup. Currently available in two trims, the Model S Plaid, which claims a sub 2 seconds 0 to 60 miles per hour time, will carry an MSRP of $138,490. The interior of the 2021 Tesla Model S will remain the same comfortable self as before and make it a worthy pick in the segment. In these years, we have seen some major changes if you ask me. But what would be your favorite changes in the Model S? Make sure to let us know in the comments section. Anyway, thank you for watching this episode. Make sure to leave a like and subscribe to our channel. We will see you in the next video.